Is that all the grass cutting done? Yeah, I'm pressing Control V and. Yeah, it takes a while for them all to come up. Oh, uh, yeah. So it does. The front one comes up first and then the back ones do. And then obviously you need to then turn them all. Okay, why is my controls all just got reversed? Uh, what? All my controls are reversed. Uh, it's because you've swapped. If you look at your driver, he's the wrong way around. So. No, I've got drive control turned off. The thingy. No, 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 no. Press F1. Oh. Press G until the uh, until the thing's on the middle, on the tractor, and then there's a button that you can press that rotates it the other way. Which button is it, Steve? Do you know? I I don't know. Press F1 and it'll tell you, and it swaps it round. Change driving direction, left That's control the B. There you go. And now it'll be back to normal. So what happened when I tried to press control V? Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah, exactly. You press control V instead. No. So con control V lifts everything up. Control B um, swaps you around. Control B swing spins you around. <laughs> I was like, left is right and forwards backwards. What's going on? <laughs> Uh, Jules, I remember loading games to the Sinclair computer via cassette tape and took ages to load, and if you listen to download sound, it sounds awful. Um, we all did. We all used cassette recorders. It was brilliant. It was wonderful. Slow, like but said, fantastic. Like I said, I've still got a tape drive. You know, the old uh, hard drive where you used to store your media. I've still got one of them. I don't use it. Like I say, it's just a antique. I'll go and get the. Uh... What are you doing there? Do you just. Te um... You need to get the wind rower. Yeah, get... I've tethered it. The rower of the wind. wind that's the one. And that's at the cows as well. Uh, logging, I don't know. Maybe next week, if we can afford it. Yeah. I'm not 100%. Yeah, next week, that's coming in. Uh, HR Hoiberg, 27 months. Keep up the good work. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you, HR. Oh, no, 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 don't do that. No, stop it. Has it done? Tipped over? Oh, it's unpacking it instead of just lowering it, the stupid thing. Yeah, don't lower it, just let it go. Let it go. go. Let it go. How did I know that was going to happen? Obviously. <laughs> honestly, honestly, we're so much alike, it's unreal. <laughs> we know what each other's going to start doing. It's just that wo those words just trigger the mm -hmm. song. They do, yeah. And I still don't get why this is called a wind rower. No idea. Don't ask me. You going past? Oh. Yeah. Yee, squeeze through. <laughs> Lag as I go around the corner, though. I wonder who defined the PTO, like the technology. Because it's, it's a bit like a USB or something, isn't it, for tractors? Pretty much, yeah. Like somebody must have had to come up with a standard for it. Andy J Stewart with 13 months. Uh, don't think you saw my prime sub into my second year. Uh, I didn't, Andy. Thank you for the 13 months, though. Having some technical difficulties today. I guess we're going to bail this lot up. Um, we 
Hmm, I don't know. See, if you look at what the animals need, mm -hmm. a bunch of them need grass. Right, well, we don't have grass. Well, we've just been cutting it. Yeah, but I've turned it into hay. Hey. I am tethering it. Well, we're going to have to do another field then and get grass. Well, we do have some grass... Um, some grass bales. Mm. We've not got many, but we've got a few. Well, we could probably make some more, is what I'm saying. So All right. That's what the animals need. Sounds good. So I'll just collect this, you know, thingy. Little hoover thing. Same for animals, grass or hay. There's a roam. Oh, I think it does enough. say, if you look at the um, uh, sheep or the pigs or something, it says like grass stroke hay, I think. Right, okay. If you drop a grass bale into a food mixer, it turns into grass. There you go. All right, well, we've got a load of hay, so that'll do. I have seen the new It movie, yeah. Want to watch Blade Runner now? Probably go and watch that. If I can't watch it this week, I'll have to watch it next week. It's fine if you bail it, just don't wrap it, says Rome. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because if you wrap it, it turns into silage. And we've already got plenty of silage. All right. Yeah, that's what I meant, BJ. Uh, the forage wagon. I've got that. But we like to call it a hoover. <laughs> la, 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 lag. Yeah, I got that as well. How was the it movie, Big Headed? Um, youngest daughter was terrified. Me and my son was laughing, mostly. It was entertaining, if you like that sort of thing. Not my style of movie, I'm afraid. No, I can understand that. Wind row is so cold because the grass is raked into a row so the wind can dry it quicker. Surely you'd spread it out to dry it quicker. I was going to say that doesn't make any sense. Does not make any that's sense. That's what the tether does. The tether uh, spreads it out and turns it over. I think you row it, you, you, you rake it into a row so that you can collect it a lot easier. Not yeah. to dry it out quicker. <clears throat> but I don't get where the wind bit comes in. Maybe it's not wind. Maybe it's wind. Maybe it's wind rower. Because you wind the thing. the rake. Unless it originally was powered by the wind. You know, like maybe have sails on it and as you drive along the wind catches it and spins it, possibly. Maybe. I'm sure Vrom will know. Yeah. From wind row because exposed to the wind for drawing. Doesn't make sense though, does it? Wind row is a row of cut mown hay or small grain crop. It's called a windrow because it makes windrows. That's the small, the rows of crops that you leave behind are called. Okay. That's just a weird name then, isn't it, Rome?
Does the game have an online feature? Uh, you can play with friends. Um, either you can host a game, or they can host a game, or you can have a dedicated server. I've been talking, Baz. I'm not staying quiet. <laughs> How much are dedicated servers, Michael Douglas? Uh, have a look on Nitrado's website. I'll tell you there. <laughs> it's alright, calculated. Spezzy supply, J10. The only thing I've got left is three of the bottles of Spezzy. I thought you were saving one can until you had all of the bottles. Yeah, I was, but I miscalculated, Steve, because I thought the bag was full of cans and bottles, but it turns right. out I was drinking the cans from the top and the bottles were underneath, so... Right, okay. Utter miscalc happened. One point four million in the bank. How much is a scorpion? Uh, something like forty-eight, uh, four, four hundred and eighty, I think. Mm -hmm. About half a million. So we can almost. probably afford the log and stuff. Yeah. Although you can also hire the uh, logging equipment. True. That's the funny thing. You can hire that equipment and then basically makes so much money in one go oh, yeah. that you can buy it then. It's yeah, just exactly. the economy is so broken. Yep, you could do exactly that. Hey, Lady Toast. Lag. Mm-hmm. You guys have certainly had a good old mix of the jobs. Yeah, I've had quite a few. Harvesting, seeding, cultivating, rowing animals. Hey, the stats, how you doing? Uh, see you, Silverbird. Uh, the word Spezzy in Bavarian dialect actually means buddy. <laughs> really? I'll have a can of buddy. Wait, no, that sounds like bud. Is that where it's meant then? Bavarian, where are Um, I don't know. Maybe. You run out of coffee. There's, n there's nothing anybody can do. You need to go to the shop right now and buy <laughs> coffee. <laughs> Even an all-night garage, they all sell coffee.
I tell you what, I was at um, the motorway service station on the way back from Cosford, right? Mm-hmm. And, um, you know, they've, you've got those Costa machines where you can just put the yeah, cup the, under. Yeah, Express Costa, yeah. I think it's called. And, like, they're all right. They're not, I mean, they taste like Costa, but the actual coffee, the milk thing, it's okay, it's not bad. Then... And I don't, you know, in preference, I always go for Costa over Starbucks. I don't like Starbucks coffee that much. I went mm -hmm. into this, cafe, this service station, and they didn't have a Costa machine. They had a Starbucks machine. So I was like, oh, God, I've got to have a Starbucks instead. I tell you what, the Starbucks machine, the mobile machine, better. makes a better coffee than the <laughs> Costa machine does. Even, even though Costa coffee, to me, tastes nicer than Starbucks, the actual yeah. machine, it takes about twice as long to make the coffee, but you... You can actually feel the machine is actually doing a proper job behind the scenes of making the coffee properly. Nice. So you take you wait longer, but the coffee that comes out is so much better. But you don't see many of those Starbucks machines. Yeah, I mean, it was Costa that actually originally started with those machines. Yeah, and obviously yeah. Star Starbucks have uh, you know, jumped Copied in it. on their soil and, and and started copying them a little bit. But yeah, I, I, I honestly, I'd rather just go up to the counter and say yeah i'll have a coffee please oh, well they, they didn't have one in the one to stop that yeah i guess it depends which uh you know big services they've normally got yeah. a couple of them i think what? the is it the um i'm trying to think what the one is that we stopped at when we went up north um weatherby weatherby they've got i think about four of them all in the same building Yeah, I understand what you mean, Buzz. You never go to Starbucks. You'd rather buy no coffee than buy bad coffee. Um. Yeah, I mean, they don't. I mean, they don't make a terrible coffee. It's just not very good. It's too milky. If you get a flat white, it's not so bad. If you start going for one of these massive coffees, though, ugh, it's just milk. Yeah, I, <clears throat> I saw one of those um, last year, Chippy. I think I tweeted out a picture of it, like a Yorkshire tea machine. I couldn't believe it. Almost uh, never have milk in your coffee, only sometimes an espresso macchiato. I just can't get on with espresso. It's just too bitter for me. I like the idea of it. Like, coffee straight to the point, you know? Don't drink very much, just get all the caffeine hits, but I just can't stand the taste of it. Is that what Dre has? I think, yeah, he has double espressos, which is like two lots. In, in Spain, they do a um, cortado, which is an espresso, and then the same amount as, as the espresso with hot milk. And that's a very strong coffee, but I can drink that. But it is a strong coffee, because it's basically an espresso, but not much milk, just enough to take the edge off it. Yeah. Get some sugar on it, it'll be fine. Yeah, but I just don't do sugar in coffee. But yeah, it would. It would definitely soften it. Some brown sugar would actually might work better. Mm, true. I uh, finished, is that you done? I finished rowing the wind for you. All right. Can you just try and get that bit down that fence? Huh? There's a bit on the near the fence in front of you. Oh, what a faff! I know, but you know, try and get everything. Might as well. Oh, cost to do cortado now. I might actually try one then. Well, I fed the cows. They've got enough grass now. Uh, I think it's just the sheep that need it now. Okay. Never 
need to find something else to do. <clears throat> well, Heyman, a double espresso is the same strength as a normal espresso. The only difference is double is twice as much. But the flavour is still the same. Jules, we've got a big Costa Cafe in my local shopping centre. They're everywhere, Jules. They're owned by Whitbread, and they're just absolutely everywhere. Thing is, though, they must be doing good if they're making, like, if they've got that many stores. Oh, yeah, I think they are making good money. Everyone wants, you know, hot beverages. Mm -hmm. It's like cafes and, like, McDonald's and stuff. They'll always make money, because people are always going to want it. You know, supply and demand. Yeah, I know, Kapitev, but... No, the problem is, it's the taste is too bitter. So even when you dilute it down, like in an Americano or something, it's just too bitter. Your mum and dad got excited when the little town got a Costa. The best things in sliced bread. Oh my god. Four pound for a coffee. Um, not usually. It's about two fifty usually. If you're paying four pound for a coffee. That's quite expensive. Good call, one, Jarrett. One more trailer full and I think I'll uh, be done on this field. Okay. Do you know what we're doing next? No idea. No idea. I just asked. Yeah, it would come be. I, I should try espresso with some brown sugar in just to see what it's like. I just try not to eat raw sugar, you know. If it's all possible. Yeah, Cortado is more my liking. Person says is more hand hand poured filter brew. Yeah, it's like the tradition. The one I used to see um, American cop shows and things like that when I was a kid. I used to remember they had like a big machine with a giant pot of coffee and they just pour black coffee and just drink mm. it, like endless amounts those. of black coffee, <laughs> always on the boil. Need to empty the silos. As they are full. Oh, okay. So empty and sell. Yeah. I'll head back there. Trailer duties. I did notice we had a million litres of wheat. Yeah. A little bit too much, possibly. It's a lot of wheat. Why? Brown sugar and car. Yeah, I really like brown sugar. It's such a nice sugar. American Diner Coffee. Well, you know where they've got the um, the big glass uh, jug, and it sits on a hot plate, and uh, you get you know you you put the filter paper in the top, put the coffee in the top, put the hot water in it, just makes a giant pot of it, and then keeps it hot for a few hours. That. But the uh, the longer you leave it, the more the stronger it gets because it kind of slowly evaporates, and so you end up with this like ridiculously strong coffee at the end. You could do one of them for the office. Yeah, it's just the faff. Just the faff of setting it up. If, you, if I drink too much coffee as well, I get hyper. <laughs> Honestly. What, it's, you're not hyper already? Yeah, I get like, you know, if you look at my eyes, which are normally white, you can see like the veins starting to bulge as the <laughs> coffee just kicks in. American Diner Coffee is more like brown water, as in what? Diluted. Because they didn't put enough coffee in.
You just have one of those sitting on your desk and it holds you up and end up drinking about 13 cups a day. That's the problem, is you, if you don't keep track of what you drink. Every time you feel a bit thirsty, you have a cup of coffee and at the end of the day, you've drunk so much, it's not actually good for you anymore. At the end of it, you'd probably end up becoming dependent on it. Oh yeah, definitely. Oh, they've got a special truck. Well, he could have said that before I hooked it all up, but yeah. Mm. The Lizard SX210 Twin Star. I see the purple trailer. Right, let's have a look who's selling the most. Prices for wheat are 722 down at OS Pacific Grain. Which is down the road to the piggies, actually. Legit, I probably have one a day, if that. And I haven't actually had one today. What's that? Monster energy. Lag as you leave the farm. <laughs> Look at the... The inside of this truck is actually better than some of the Euro truck mods. <laughs> Although I feel like I'm sat 20 yards away from the steering wheel My daughter actually drives like this It's really weird Both my daughters, one of them drives Like with a seat right back and her, and her arms like this And then the other one sits You know like some people you see And they're sat like on the wheel Like right up to it like this mm -hmm. How can you drive like that? Can you possibly drive like that? The airbag won't even inflate you that close. Body dislikes monster drinks. Fair enough. THU31 with eight months. How long till Christmas, Paul? Uh, 70 something days, I think we said. THU, what was it? Uh, 73. Oh, 73. Almost set down to 72. Wait, am I in the right place? I don't think I am. Yes, I am. Pacific Grain. Uh, what? What's up? Well, apparently I'm clipping on something, but I... Oh, it's the wheels. The wheels and the... Uh beam things, the wooden strut things, that. It's a lot bigger than where it actually is. Wow, is the hitbox just completely broken? Yep. Right. That thing keeps tipping upwards. We're all going to be in trouble. Get the money. 
Indeed. It's a lot. Your auntie sits right up to the wheel like that. My mate sits right back. He's six foot, though. Yeah, but I'm six foot two. I don't sit like that. I think your arm should be roughly 90 degrees when you're holding the wheel. Wow. That's a lot of money. <laughs> it is. And we're done. Bit of an awkward drop off point for this trailer. Yeah, we'll probably crash the price, Heyman. <laughs> Dumping that much wheat into the market. On my way back up to the farm. Okay. Somebody's still sat there. Wow. <laughs> Do you expect any different? Wheat. Imagine if someone took Google Street View images and buildings and put them in the truck sim game. That would be awesome. Yeah. I mean, it would look rubbish. That's the problem. Like, functionally, it would it would work, but... It would be 2D. The images would be so bad. The texturing, you know, from satellite distances, the textures would be really bad. This thing accelerates slowly. I need a bigger truck. Well, I found your orange one. What? The orange tractor? No, the orange truck. It was down near the cow. Was it? Hmm. Random. Sounds well. And it goes 62 miles an hour. <laughs> Lag. Yep. Need to find your trailer now. Google Earth in VR. Google Earth in VR is actually really cool. You're drinking a gluten free American Pale Ale. It tastes like a light version of an IPA. The orange truck has more power than the purple one, from. Oh! <gasps> Oh my god! There goes a wild kibberton. This one, this one is a little bit quicker. Yeah. <laughs> Do you know where your orange trailer is? I have no clue. Probably best to just look on the uh, panel mm. thing. What 
1.6 million to start with. <laughs> they just boom that. <laughs> they just boom you going around the corner. <laughs> oh, it's at the shop. Does it, it, it come from there? Yeah, price is coming down. It was like 700 euros, now it's 639. Because we're just flooding the market. It's actually, it's actually better now to take it to blue line feeds. Hold on, I see you. Hey. Hey. What, so you can drive my truck and it's quicker? Yep. <laughs> There's blue line. Oh my god, it's right down there. Nope. How do you attach the trail? Uh, do you have to reverse in and press Q or oh, get no, out and press Q? Try it. Mikey, I've got the GT, uh, GT Omega one. The wheel stand. Not yet, J10. Right on top of it. I'm right on top of it and it's just not doing it. Really? Doesn't like doing this. Can I hear me? Oh, I've got it. Really? It worked. Yeah, you have to do it from inside the cab. What? Well, I did say press Q, and then after doesn't work, jump out and press Q. Yeah, I was jumping out and pressing Q. Probably an old school mod. Mm. Yeah, that's a big difference in truck right there. It is. Yours is more like a Kenny. Mine's more like a mm. Peterbilt. I like the sound on this one. Yeah, it sounds a lot better than this one. Yeah, but it doesn't look as good inside. Inside, it looks like the really bad, awful ETS mods. Although it is definitely quicker than that one. Oh, definitely. A lot quicker than this one. Boop! <laughs> what could possibly go wrong with this? <laughs> we'll try it when you fully load it. I'll give you a, give you a helpful push. Look at that, you went from 68 kilometers an hour to 75. <laughs> Although I'm maneuvering, this thing is not as easy. Hey, you just wait till you get to the drop off point. <laughs> yeah. Uh, trucks, with all the trucks you don't get to get out with the attached detached trailers, you don't have the IRL to attach a trailer. Hmm. True, Rome. But you could argue you should get out and attach the brake lines. That's true. What are we taking? Wheat? Uh, I've just been grabbing wheat here. Yeah. Plenty of different stuff. Of There's lots of all kinds of things. Uh, we'll take wheat and then I'll follow you. This is going to take a while. It does. Although I've just noticed that this trailer's got a back attacher 
So we could get a dolly with another trailer. Yeah, good luck getting that through that drop-off point. <laughs> exactly. Because you'll need it. Uh-huh. Hey. You're keeping an eye on the uh, fill level there, sir. I'm trying to get in the back. There we go. There we go. Yeah. Yeah, but you walk underneath the crop. Hey, Mom. I'm getting covered in grain. <laughs> Yeah, he's going to bury you any oh, second. Oh, we're going to get buried. Heads disappeared. I'm actually inside. <laughs> yep, you've disappeared on my street. And I'm full. Oh, what the ants are we now? Oh, are they in trucks as well? Super busy on the tractor. Oh, lol. Wow. You're so funny, Motley. Did he unhook it? Yeah. Oops. Oops. <laughs> Sorry, my, my steering just went a bit funny there. I had that problem earlier. Yeah, Sammy, so it's, you know, every now and again the steering doesn't work. Linking up. Push. Boosted. Ooh, 68, 69. Be about 43 miles an hour. Can't seem to get 70 k's. Yeah, you can when you're empty. If I if I back off, what's your speed up there? Uh, well, up the hill, 54 k. Fair enough. Coming in for a ram. Ramming speed. 70, 83, 84. Whoa. Oh my god. There's a pause there, sir. Yes, there is. It's like V1, <laughs> rotate. No going back now. It really was. No, oh, I see what you mean. I hope these trees are not clippable. Ah, that's good. Okay. Oh, you guys are booming everything tonight. They really are. Did it reach the maximum? Don't think it did. And you thought driving trucks was easy. Mm. It's too late now to boom it. You have to do it quickly. Yeah, you've, you've missed your opportunity. It takes a while to empty them, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah, it does. It's a lot. Also, that truck at the top of your overlay for the boom thing. Yeah. It looks like a Southwest truck. Uh, you know, like red, blue with the stripes. All the colours, yeah. Yeah. You know what you mean? Uh, you can select a different unload mode by pressing U so it unloads three times the speed. Yeah, but where does it unload? <laughs> Out the side. Six nine nine. Yeah, we've still got more wheat than anything else at the moment. I actually do know what Optimus yeah. Prime is. I have actually watched that film. We need to stop selling wheat now because we've collapsed the price here. Yeah. It's on 482. It was on 700. Let's go into sunflower or canola. So, yeah. Well, sun, sunflower um, price has stayed the same. Canola, the price has gone down. Let's dump sunflower. All right. And then we'll do pork belly. No, okay. Jay. Oh, uh, Sammy. I saw that, he cut you up. 
Coming in for ramming speed. Go on, ram. Ram me into Sammy. Do it. Do it. <laughs> Sammy's getting boosted. <laughs> We're coming up to a corner. This is going to be genius. He's getting properly boosted over this range. Oh, this is awesome. Look at this. It's hard to keep your trailer, I know. like the truck onto your trailer. Especially, he's trying to break. He's, he's trying to he break is, us. He is oh, what a scumbag. How can the brakes on that track to be the that good? I actually stopped as well, so if you accelerate now. I'm accelerating. Right, we're slowly pushing. Make sure you press shift four, five. Oh, they tank got four. Two right. trucks cannot stop a tractor. That's ridiculous. Yeah, it's Hang on, I've got an idea. Right. Boost, 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 boost. I'm boosting, but it's and not working. <laughs> What? Uh, we can sandwich him. Let's sandwich him. <laughs> yes. Oh, God. <laughs> We've got a sammy sandwich. Into a tree. We've got a sammy sandwich. Oh, he's oh, cut off. Oh, dear. Uh-oh. That's, that's going to be fun. That was Sammy. He did that. Uh -huh. I, I saw that. I'll slowly reverse. Sammy definitely did that. Oh, he's coming for me now. Look. He's trying to put me on this fence. Definitely Sammy's fault. <laughs> I was just going to push you, but I can't because Sammy's currently making me a jackknife. Yeah, he is. He's having his revenge now. That's it. He's trying to put me on the fence. Uh-oh. I thought that would work, but it didn't. <laughs> right, I'm, I'm trying to come up to you now. I've got the trailer Sammy on top of my alone. truck. <laughs> Sammy's just not leaving me alone. <laughs> he won't let it lie. Yeah, you're well and truly stuck there, sir. Yep. Do you want this crop selling or not, Sammy? Found oh, really? Crop. Really? He's like, yeah, you get yourselves out of that. Look what he's done to me. <laughs> he's put me over the oh, fence as well. Yeah, yeah. He has. Every time you hit that trailer, it's kind of... It's like hey, a God. weeble. It just writes itself. It's hilarious. Got yours out, for Oops. Went the wrong way. Kid Funkadelic, that's Sommy. Hmm. Exactly. Ping! And we're off again. That's it. Teamwork makes the dreams work. Ma 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 Kawoda. Right, what are we. Uh, Sunflower. Sunflower. Can you move a little bit further forward? That'll do. That'll do. Just so that Kawoda can get out. <laughs> And where are we taking it? Oh, yeah, Sunflower yeah. to Blue Line Feeds. Uh, Sammy, what do you mean we didn't get ourselves into any predicament? Well, there's no predicament at all. We got ourselves out of a predicament that someone else put us in. Exactly. Listen very carefully. Weebles wobble, but they don't fall down. Hashtag blame mm -hmm. Sommy. I remember that advert. Oh, here he is. Oh, he's again, here. Bro. He's here. Go on. Off you go. I can't now. Well, it's alright. I'll push you in a sec when I get round there. Yeah, it needs pushing from the opposite end. On my way. I can get myself out if I wanted to, but. Just be steady because of uh, Sommy. There is a lamp post there as well. Oh, oh come well, on. you know. You've been absolutely serious. That's below the belt, that is Sammy. That's below the belt. He's wasting our money now. That is absolutely below the belt, that. No, I'll just sit here. I'll, I'll block all the grain silo and everything. Drive forward so it should just pull round. It won't. Hmm. How's that, then? There we go. Kind of work. Right, sunflowers. He's going to put one in front of the truck. Yeah, he's he's playing that card now. Mm-hmm. Steve, don't start with that song. I've still got I've got a brand new combine harvester. Oh well. Ooh are ooh are.
Yeah, nearly four. Uh, 87. Takes forever. There we go. Hmm. Who was that just dropped right in that front of us? Motley. Motley, you say? Mm hmm. Okay, go. Let's go. Clamming speed. As a week keeps it not bad. Uh, Vin Choco Blob, just dropping by. Have a nice evening, Paul. Thank you, Vin. Thank you for 16 months. Starish Kitsuna, thank you for 16 months as well. Uh, because you're the door, I just need to fix my overlay a bit. Satisfied. Clamming speed again. Nitrous. Hing! 84. <laughs> Is it here that we're going? Oh, look, there's Sammy. Oh, yeah, with a bunch of uh, thing. Oh, well. It's funny because that's not where we're going. No. And you forgot about that entrance. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Sammy. Although, he's going to. Well, of course he's, he's going to block, block us in. Of course he is. Oh, actually, actually, no, he won't. Why you not? stay there. You you unload, I'll stay here. Why wouldn't he? But if I stay here, he can't place them there. Why? Because I'm covering it, and it won't let him. Huh? Because my truck is where he wants to place them, it won't let him. So all you need to do is come out of there, drive to where I am, block the entrance, and then he can't place them. And then I can empty, and then we swap, and then I drive out. If you right. know what I mean. Okay. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, he's removing them. <laughs> Look at him. He's removing all the little uh, jet washes are placed around his tractor. <laughs> oh, did you place them there? Yeah. <laughs> <Lol>. <laughs> Surrounded his tractor with jet washes. I just removed them all. <laughs> I didn't know it was you that placed them. I thought it was him. You can swing around the back there now. Right, I've chose to empty out of the side door. I don't know how quicker it's going to be. Me neither. Let's have a look. Oh, he's still doing it out the back. Oh, it isn't. What's it doing? Right. Oh, God. It's oh, God. This is not going to end well. Uh oh, I, I uh -oh. knew it was a bad idea. Is it going to tip up even more? Um... Uh, that's not good, Steve. Your back wheels are off the ground. It's empty, though, so that's good. It didn't take too long. I'm happy with that. Right, <sighs> off we go. Oh. There's a Sony again. And did you see that? He, I did. He so nearly bend it. I saw that. Kind of oh, clipped that... the corner and it just nearly tipped if over. If it had flipped over, I'd have been lalling so hard. <laughs> lalling. <laughs> oh, we're at it again. Look, look at that. <laughs> oh, my God. It's our oh, turn to Oh, look at that. That's wow, pink tractor, that is. That's oh, pink I tractor. Oh, I see what's going on. Look at this. Wanton crop destruction. Look at this. <laughs> look at this. As if wow. this was never going to happen. Uh -huh. <laughs> look at that. I'm being mounted by Luke. 
<laughs> oh, look at that. Who's I'm on top of Motley right now. <laughs> look at that. Look, Motley's look on his Luke. side. Look at Luke on the combine. He's on his side. He's like, I'm a little duck. I can't get up. <laughs> He's like a tortoise on his back. Can you see Motley underneath me? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Luke's just put his pipe out as if to say, help. Yeah, he's like, put his hand he's up. He's his hand up at the I'm back good. of the glass. He's Look. like, me, he's going to go to the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, poor old Luke. Oh, Mrs. Geek Thumb's getting in. Look, uh -huh. look. I see this. Look, the Weeble is back on its feet. Then what they say about Weebles. <laughs> <laughs> that's oh, why Sommy's so coming for it. Oh, yeah, it's obvious that's, there was a plan. That's why Sommy was um, It's obvious there, there was a plan. <laughs> oh, dear. I just had a steering issue again. Lol. Well, all them lot are on wash-up duties. They've got to clean all the equipment. I guess we're packing everything away now. Aye. Whoa! My, my trailer just snapped back into position. Yeah, somebody just rammed you at the back, I think. That was fun. Oh dear. Well, I think we're 11 o'clock, though. We are indeed. Oh, have you gone around that way? Yeah, I just went over here. Out the way. <laughs> I'll turn around. It's a good way to end it. Tuz? No, there's no equipment damage in this game. Thankfully. <laughs> yeah, because that would be million. That would be just crazy. And there you go, another week of farming. Indeed. Ah, right, peeps, we're done. We got some work done tonight. <laughs> uh, a little bit. We've we've done all sorts tonight, haven't we? We're seeding, spraying, yeah. with the uh, slurry. Cultivating. Ga grass, yeah, yeah. Cutting. Done a fair bit. Yeah. And with the jag at the beginning. The jag. In fact, there was two jags. There was two, yes. Everybody's getting on TV. I hate it when they jump on top. Yeah, you get your feet in your face. Mm. Right, guys, we're done. Thanks for giving some GGs to the team. A splendid evening. Steve, do you want to say goodnight to the Strum? Indeed, good night all. It's been a pleasure as always, and uh, we'll catch you next week. If not through the week, or through the window. Through the window? God! <laughs> look at me, look at me. You're on my TV, Mo. Right, bye, th guys, thanks for watching. I'm going to head out now and go and eat a Tommy Tuckers. Mm -hmm. Steve's going from McDonald's, McDonald's. Kentucky Fried Chicken and a Pizza Hut. Not all of them, yeah, just McDonald's. <laughs> That would be cool if he did that in one night, just went for three takeaways. Oh, God, no. <laughs> uh, there's my uh, McDonald's burger, there's some Kentucky Fried Chicken, and to finish it all off, a Pizza Hut. Exactly. But yeah, they forgot about Domino's and, Bur you know, like, Burger King and... Yep. But well, never mind. No, it's been fun. It's a pleasure as always. Never a chore. Look at this. It's like the Waltons now looking at this image. <laughs> <laughs> Can I jump by? <laughs> right. That's, uh, that's it from me, guys. Thank you for watching. Hope you had fun. Have a great evening, and I'll see you tomorrow. It's good night from me. And good night from him. Take it easy, guys. Love you all. Good night. Good night.